to navigate, but it seems like we won't even have a second because we are just getting into the next match. We got Vivi versus Zamba, a staple, a classic. Yeah, and Vivi playing well. Honestly, it's it's getting more and more regular that Vivi gets these uh, top eights. It seems winner side. Oh, that's going to be just a back throw through a bit of stage control. Now that's Vivi with no double jump, and Zamba just is able to set up a tech chase with that four -day. That was so big. Just because Vivi wasted that double jump, he knew. Zamba knew that he was all out of defensive options and was just able to chase him down. One thing that's interesting, Vivi opted to go Lucario instead of Hero. I feel like I've seen him go uh, Hero versus Rob before, but you know what? Lucario is Lucario, and you can back air a Rob sub 100 a quarter into the stage and kill him. So that was so huge right there. And I mean, it's so nice to like get a lead with Lucario right here because there's just potential for the whole match to ramp out of hand right here. And Vivi just playing so well right now. Going to be getting the B reverse neutral B into downer as well. That's just so much good damage. Already 56 on board. That nail is one of the safest moves in the game. If you if you if that hits your shield, you're just like, hey. You respect that. You're like, hey, that happened. I'm gonna do something else. Yeah, that on top of Lucario's airspeed, like he can just nair and then be halfway across the stage with one short hop, you know. Especially with all of his like funny little B reverses. Lucario's like if you're not used to his movement, he can be one of the slipperiest yeah. like characters it's in the very, game. It can be very tough to lock him down. And right here, Zamba, we saw him take that stock with a really late bear, which you never really see Rob's do. You know, I feel like you usually bear the top of your shield and like fast fall down. Zamba mixing up that timing really well. <gasps> he had him. He had him. He had that chase down. He was tracking him. He, he had the scent for blood. That was so good. Wow. The scent for blood stain. This now both times, Zamba, you know, every Rob and like, yeah, every Rob loves to do like a jump in air, and, but it can be caught out if you read it. And Vivi's been able to catch these with the um, back airs and almost killed Zamba right there. And once again, catching Lovely. that nair. Catching that nair, you can't do it if you get red. And, and Vivi is still like playing this so confidently. You know, he's on his second stock right now. He has a lot of like ideas of how he wants to be catching Zamba's jumps, of how he wants to be pressuring him. And then specifically, when he gets like the charge of the Orlis field, he is catching a lot of Zamba's next options beautifully. And that's so huge. 44% just honestly is so nice, even if you lose the stock, because it just like gets you in that percent range where you can get more combos and pressure and tech chase going, you know? Excellent and dash attack. Yeah, dash attack is such a fast option for Lucario. I went for that same jump with Vivi. You, you got a heart. You hit us in a heart. Even if you didn't hit Zamba, oh my goodness, he's going through all of those down tilts. Vivi's having none of it. Yeah. Just, just jumps up like saying, hey bud, I don't know what you're up to. I don't know what kind of behavior you're engaging in because I'm not, I'm not a fan of it. Star, I'll be honest with you, that seemed like some shaky play from Zamba. I feel like Zamba did a lot of really predictable jumps, um, just throwing out these nares, you know, kind of like entry level Rob stuff. I feel like Zamba was not super on point with mix-up game. Vivi totally just knew exactly where Zamba was going to be that whole set. Like there was never really a point where VV kept getting red over and over yep. even with like such strong uh, down tilts. That was an accident. I'm trying I'm trying to fix my replay tablet. It's a little it's a little like funky. Oh, Devin, can you help please? Thank you. Um anyways, game two. I feel like the biggest thing is like Zamba just needs to make sure he, like he's tightening up his damage. Um and and he's like not finding like a lot of his kill uh, like kills. I feel like a lot of times he just goes for a lot of down tilts that I really lose, and Vivi just kind of gets out of it. Yeah, no, Vivi I feel like never was at a point where uh, he was like super at risk of dying early or anything, and Rob has that capability, and you have to be going for it. I'd like to see more gyro in play, honestly. You can shut down, um, with, not only with gyro, can you kind of shut down Orsphere a bit, you know, if that's on the ground and like totally stops it. Uh, it's a really nice option against Lucario. It's also like your biggest tool for gaining early kills, you know, for really exploiting Lucario's weakness. Just charging Orgus for a little bit, trying to hunt this landing. That spot dodge was amazing. Yeah, that was so smart. VV is playing perfect right now. <laughs> uh, super on point. Impeccably even. Wow. Man, man is, man is saucing. I'm, I'm a big fan of this. Oh. But it doesn't matter. <laughs> doesn't matter, it baby. Doesn't matter. <laughs> got back your big, got back your strong. So, so it just ends up killing at any point. But. Right now, this is where Vivi's gonna struggle to kill, right? Because he doesn't have the momentum, he doesn't have the pressure, he needs a back kill, he needs a side B, he needs an F smash. And now Zamba is looking out for it. No, no rage, no aura, and and none of that is killing. Yeah, I feel like Zamba right now is not gonna want like any straight hits. Zamba's gonna only fish for a big combo starter because that's gonna be like you don't wanna give Lucario a rage right here. You wanna just do such a strong combo that you have a good amount of percent for when you die. 
next stock you can start off strong so yeah just only fishing for nair really and not able to get too much but now 40. this is the biggest struggle with lucario it's like if you don't really have this oil if you don't have this rage you're killing at 181. yeah that's not the ideal especially when gob can basically kill you at any percent that he so chooses yeah this is this is you know kill through that as maybe the most amount of like win conditions in the cast <laughs> that was yeah that was weird i think like uh, Zama got hit by like the charging yep. hit before the Ors were released, and, and it popped him yeah. like in a strange direction before like the projectile like hit. So, little, little, little funky situation, not anticipated, but Vivi's making a bit of a comeback. Yeah, this is like the most pivotal point of the match right here. It's really if Vivi can manage to just like at the very least do a good amount of damage before losing this stock, because I feel like this is either where Zama runs away or Vivi gets the comeback. It's within these next few seconds. <gasps> he had it too. I'm not really sure if that dash attack was intentional, but at least it was like a nice bit of a getaway option. He had the jump lead with the laser, finds it down, and nonetheless, Zamba is hunting for the up Hey, you should be up there. <laughs> <laughs> that should be me. Yeah. I'm the god player right now. Uh, uh, that was a really important up here, though. Like, and because now, Zamba just has to, like, stay, like, really, like, kind of just play really evasive and can just wait till Vivi gives Zamba a good combo opening and can just, you can honestly just lose your stock right here now. I, I love down tilt jab. It's just so funny. He's just beating the hell out of you. Yeah. Bop, bop, bop. And then smack. I like up tilt. I think the animation's hilarious. All of Gob's animations are really funny. Like isolation. You know? But then uh, you consider the character and, and what he does to you. And it's yeah. like, well, this isn't so funny anymore. <laughs> Me when I get hit by six down airs. Dying of laughter. Or down tilt. Sorry. It's like, ah, GG's, man. This was, that was funny. Oh, no. This is not funny right here. But, Gyro on ledge. But it's Vivi. It's Vivi, right? It's, it's a good old cliche Lucario. It is Vivi with Rage, last stock. Or, uh, you know, almost maxed out at about now. So so this is this is really scary for Zamba. You gotta, you gotta play evasively, you gotta play really carefully, because Vivi knows his safe buttons. He is pressuring your shield. You're not gonna up smash him for free. It's new. It's neutral. Respect it. And this, yeah, I was about to say, that whole time, Gyro was sitting there, and that's so nice for Vivi, because I feel like Gyro's the biggest tool to shut down Lucario with, like, this giant aura sphere right now. And now... Mamma mia. That should have been it. Living that, yeah. No rage. Rage is mm -hmm. super important on throws. And totally just not caring at all about that laser. Zama can very easily die right now. 151% on Lucario. Oh, oh my goodness. Vivi. Vivi. <laughs> what a win on Zamba. That is so good. You know what I love about those oil spring charges? It's like he saw that air dodge and everything, and he chose still the least committal option in that moment. He saw he saw all of this. He saw that directional air dodge back down. He didn't go at this point. He didn't go for the back air. He didn't go for like a run upside B or anything. He sat there and just charged neutral B because of how much pressure it exerts. It covers roll in, and it still gives you access to such a powerful projectile at this point. Yeah. Because now, look what happens. Gets hit, rolls in by it. And that's death. And Vivi's follow-ups here. Oh, delicious. Yeah, that is such a sick looking Spicy. follow up. It looks so cool. Yeah. Um and so one thing that's so pivotal about that pivotal about that is um mm -hmm. Zamba died to a roll in. That's how Zamba died last game too, last dog. A lot of roll ins killed Zamba. Roll in on that's Bear. That's the classic. That's who's that Zamba. That's yeah. I feel like, you know, Zamba's such an amazing player when he's composed, but then once he loses a little bit of momentum, when he starts playing a little bit nervous, it's always the goals in. It's the landing with neutral legs. I was about to say, the Nairs, yeah. And Vivi exploited both of that so perfectly. Mm -hmm. I mean, I feel like Vivi, you can tell Vivi's played Zamba before. You can tell Vivi's played you can Trillion tell this Rounds man before. Plays this game. Yes, yes. Plays this game well. Vivi Nixie Grand Final, or Winner's Finals. That's going to be really fun.